In this lecture, we'll learn how to plot pi, donut, and chi chart or plot. Uh, let me just go in there and you have a so you come to basic 2D and we are going to learn how to do these pie charts and these donut and also kite. An origin gives us so much flexibility with how to visualize all these data. So we start with this data point that are randomly generated. Let's just go to file and then and then save us. Let's call it pi. So pi is p and then d and then k. So pi do not kite. And I'll attach this Excel as well. So you can, if you don't want to type it in, you can just use the Excel and import it. So let's begin. So the first one is our pi. So let's just select the first two a and b and go to plot and go to basic 2d and go to 3d pi chart so this is what we have and let's zoom in so okay the first thing is i like the way origin is dynamic you can just come in here and let's say for health type 7 any changes so you can always customize what you have in here so let's zoom in now so you have this pie chart this is also basic you may want to edit it so what you do is the first thing you want to do is you just click once and there are some basic things that you can do like fill color border color you can rotate clockwise you can rotate you can also show data labels so now you're seeing percentage you can choose you can change to values you can change to categories you can go ahead and edit range and settings so you can do all these things um, in there yeah you can have all these things here and you have your legion which also corresponds so you can edit them as well so we'll go ahead and just double click and it, it brings up the plot details so there are so many things that can be done here you can start with let's say the border you can start with the border pattern you can change now it's white you can change that you can go ahead change the style you can change the width so just like our usual customizing, you can do all these, change the fill. So the fill is changing by point, but now you can also go to single. So oh, every, everything can be done in there with these editing tools, adding pattern and adding that. So now you've chosen the bulk. You can also select just one side of it. So you select let's say this section and double click and now you can customize just that one and it will, it will help so the other thing that can be done is just double click and then you can come to the pie geometry so now this is a 3d view if you want 2d you can just type 90 in there as a saying and it just changes it to 2d for you you can also change the view so maybe if you want 45 uh, you can do that so the other thing is um, when you're plotting 2d if you come to plot the next one will be basic it will be 2d so it's just the same way you can plot 2d or 3d but once you come in to pie geometry and change it it will change you can change the thickness let's go extreme so now you've changed the thickness you can do that if you want this if this is how you want to represent your data you can do that and you can just play with some of these things you can change the rotation so you don't like maybe you want more of this side to show you can change the rotation as you want and uh, you'll get that you can also explode if you want so let's say you want to explode the 
technology you can explode that and you can change the displacement maybe you can change it to 50 and you can explode that as well so this is why i like origin it's very flexible for you you can add um labels to it so first of all you can also change the font and all that you can change these editors you can check this and add values which 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 are your data sheets or add categories in your data sheet so you have r d and all you can also add lead leader lines so this connector is a straight line let's change it to a three segment and let's change the thickness to maybe three hit apply you can go back to okay and drag it around if you want so so many ways of customizing your graph and that is why i love origin because you can do all these things using origin and note you can do same for the 2d section the next one will be plot and then basic 2d and you also have a donut so that is the same you just select plot if you want to make a donut plot that is up to you so it's the same it's just a donut you have these and all these things can be customized as well you can double click go to pi geometry maybe you can change the whole color as well and wedge thickness can be applied and let's let's see if the 3d works yeah so i don't think the 3d will work for that approach so take note of that but that is all about donuts it's just the same way but it's it's just gonna give you a donut plot the next will be the pie of pie which i love so it's the same way now if you want to blow this section up so you have health to be 36 r d engineering and you have at 12 then it shows you this side maybe called something else now you have maybe ai and now you have ai in ai you have eight percent of of this to be to be automobile and the rest to be technology so you can also edit it you can come into wedge and let's say you want to add art to it uh, to that you can just apply and then now this changes to 32 and you have art included to it maybe you want to add more it's, it's up to you you can also do that in there and the rest of the editing are just the same you can customize each of them and once you change to 3d once again i believe it will go away so let's try yeah so it will go away for that so make sure you don't do that yeah the next one will be plot basic 2d and bar of pi so it's the same instead of a pi of pi now you have a bar instead of a pi and you can use that to blow so you can edit this as you want the next one will be plot and basic 2d you can also have a pie of a donut so when you blow this up note you can change it to whatever one that you want maybe you want it to blow out okay so you want to blow out maybe health and turbo there you go now you've blown it out so and you can customize them to be more interesting as we've done and finally go to plot basic 2d you can have pi with different so different you can change you can customize this too to have it's not like in one circle you can have it this way and edit it and you can also have do not with different way so so let's say yeah kite is also important you can come in and kite is more like a density plot where the highest is like b 
bigger so health is the bigger portion of it and then you have maybe otobobo as the least so it gives you kind of like a kite plot and you can come in and edit them also which is which is a nice tool to have so that being said that will be it for pi donut and kite and i believe this has given you an idea of how you can make your you can visualize your data and make it so interesting um, if you put this in a conference paper or in a presentation uh, your your viewers will be more excited 